We head into our 149 match. A couple injuries for Purdue. They were shorthanded against Northwestern. They ended up getting the win. It'll be Alec White for Purdue against its returning Mike Carr. Carr was out last season with an injury. Qualified for the NCAA tournament the two seasons prior to that. And Jakey's looking to get right back where he started. Yeah, absolutely. He's doing the best he can to stay healthy and do things right. Keeping those knees healthy and the one works harder in the room than Mikey Carr, that's for sure. Qualified for the NCAA tournament twice, both at 141. Good single, kind of sweeps to a single. It finishes like a double there for Mikey Carr. Gets the takedown, and Mike Carr takes a 2 to nothing lead here in the first. Yeah, we're probably going to see Mikey Carr trying to keep his pace up here, having a heavy gas tank. Really wears on his opponents and takes advantage there in that third period, usually. Probably going to see White here trying to build up. He's got that left wrist trapped. Alec White, redshirt sophomore out of New Palestine, Indiana. Had a 6-6 six and six record at 141 last season before he had gotten injury at the Midlands Championship and had season-ending surgery. Mikey Carr got him real heavy on those hands, taking that left side wrist. Big shot there from Mikey Carr, and he's going transition in that claw. See him trying to build that riding time. We're close to a minute here in the first of riding time. White gets the escape, and it's two to one for Mike Carr. Carr at that try meet Sunday against Ohio State and Wisconsin. Ran into the top-ranked wrestler Sammy Sasso from Ohio State, ended up losing by fall, and bounced back with an 8-3 decision win against Drew Scherenbrock from Wisconsin. See Alec White trying to control that center there. Mikey Carr's not going to stop moving. Really good left side single there from Mikey Carr. He's going to try and pull it in here. We got pretty short time. We're just under 20 seconds. Alec White's got a heavy ankle wizard there on Mike Carr's shoulder, but he's climbing up. 10 seconds left here in the first. 10 seconds left on that edge. He's got that left ankle, though. They're probably going to call two here. Carr gets a takedown right at the end of the first period and his second takedown. And he'll take a 4-1 to one lead into the second. Yeah, there's definitely some really good man awareness there from uh, Mikey Carr. Trying to scare that takedown quickly, but not getting sloppy there on that edge and scaring that outside ankle. First meeting between Carr and White, but Carr has wrestled against Purdue January 21st of the 2017-2018 season at Holloway Gym at Purdue. Took a 9-5 decision win over Nate Limix, wrestling at 141. Granby attempt there from White. He kind of gets his leg caught up in a really good foul there from Mikey Carr. Carr already a minute 30 of riding time. And he's keeping that pressure forward here, making it real tough for Alec White to get out. Big chop there on that left arm. Two takedowns in the first from Mike Carr. Alec White fights hands there, and he cuts out there for a quick one. Yeah, Mikey Carr here on the edge. An escape for White, 4-2 to two lead for Mike Carr, and he... Already builds up with just under a minute left here in the second. Already has a minute 56 of riding time. Shot attempt there from Alec White. And Mikey Carr, those real heavy hips. He's trying to get to a single of his own. We have nothing there. Good action for both guys. Another single from Mikey Carr. Carr in on the and a quick right leg. He finishes it out. And the third takedown of the match for Mike Carr. Yeah, Mikey Carr's throwing a lot of fakes in there. 
Getting uh, White there to bite. And just getting those quick singles and go-behinds. He's got riding time here up over two minutes as well, so. Under 20 seconds left. Probably just gonna try and finish the period here on top. Maybe even look for a tilt here. Five seconds left, Carr trying to get any back points he can, but we'll head into the third. Mike Carr up six to two over Alec White. Yeah, Mikey Carr's looking really strong here on his feet with those singles. Finishing them low and quick. It's close here to locking that riding time as well. So right now with the riding time, it would be a five-point win for Carr. Jake, what are we going to see here? Are we possibly going to see some takedowns and cuts, or yeah, is he going to try to get back points? Yeah, we definitely see Mikey Carr probably trying try to pick up that pace here and get some takedowns and some quick cuts, try and get that major. Those always play a big factor here in the end of the duel, or those bonus points. He's here in a high post position off another su sweet single. He's going to try and finish here in the back door. White trying to keep a hold of that right ankle. Yeah, tough spot to finish with White tying up those ankles. Minute seven, four point lead for the number seven wrestler in the nation at 149, Mike Carr. Pushing forward here, trying to get the, some more fakes in. There's Mikey Carr. He's controlling that center too as well. Another low single there from Mike Carr. He's gonna be trying to finish it up through the back door again. But Alec White's got those ankles tied up. You see him trying to free that left ankle as Mikey Carr. Carr fought off that right hand initially. White back in on that left ankle. Yeah. And really another whistle with the stalemate will go back to the middle. Another really good shot there from Mikey Carr. Tough spot to finish it when he got those ankles all sort of caught up. 30 seconds left here in the match. Yeah, another shot from Mikey Carr. He's gonna try and finish it here like a double, not enough getting his ankles caught. He's close to that edge. You don't wanna watch his knee there as a potentially. He's gonna get one for an illegal hold there, is Mikey Carr. Point for Carr, makes it seven to two. He's trying to get some takedowns here. It's Mikey Carr, he's backing on that single again. Takedown would make it an eight point win. Struggling to finish in this back door though. He's had some really good singles here. Time winding down, and final score will be an eight to two decision win for Illinois' Mike Carr. Yeah, really solid showing there for Mike Carr. A lot of really good singles and pressing forward that entire match and locking that riding time as well.